fully healed. Fully energy. I'm going to use another EMP grenade on this. Although I could totally just run through, actually. What are the, what are the turrets going to do, eh? Yum. Just in case the vault door wanted to close through as a part of, like, a security thing. Yum. Very nice. So, the other codes, though, we don't know yet. I wonder if we ever do know. No email. Lame. There's, there's the uplink. Oh, hey. We did certainly teach you how to fight, didn't we? You're worried, Simons. We almost have a cure. You have nothing. Even if Everett succeeds, you can't synthesize enough vaccine to stop an epidemic. You need a universal constructor, and don't think Page Industries is going to leave one lying around for you to use. Not after you blew up the one in Hong Kong. I was never properly trained in its operation. Laugh it up, Denton. Next time we won't use an old box of bolts like Gunter. The only reason I let him go to Paris is that I was sick of his moaning about Navarra and constant requests for a tune-up. You sent him because you knew he would fight to the death. He was the last of the mechs. Next time you will face someone of your own abilities. I was a little bit hoping that when I fought Gunther, he'd have a machine gun on his forehead. Like he always wanted. <laughs> Alright, so... Is there a side job to do here, too? Just retrieve the dragon's tooth sword? Okay. And then I'll wait for other instructions. Alright. Make contact with the Illuminati in Paris where the former Illuminati leader Morgan Everett is rumored to be hiding. Yeah, I mean, we... There's not, like, a special login that I have to use or anything, right? Like, we just... I kind of expected somebody to be like... Oh my god, you did it. Oh, so cool. Or something. I'm getting what I need. Good work. I will now consent to meet you in person. Go to the metro station nearby and await my instructions. Get it. It's all making sense now. Alright, so we'll meet up with him then outside. Fine, fine. Got him all turned around. I'm coming. <laughs> Wait, I have an idea. <laughs> Come on over. No, it's fine. Denton. I will take you to Everett, <laughs> but you will be forced. See, no inconvenience whatsoever. Everett must be paranoid. Uh. We all are. Uh. The Illuminati is getting a taste of its own medicine. Has he made any progress on the Great Death Virus? Your uplink <laughs> provided the missing encryption. There were no edits during any of that. <laughs> complete the work that Presser Tong began. I must see him at once. He is downstairs in the lab. Am I okay? <laughs> Ow. Uh. My bar is all mixed around. My inventory is all mixed around. What happened? We're going to wind it back, but I'm very curious. <laughs> Ow! Okay. I'm not immortal. JC Denton, I will take you to Everett, but you will be forbidden to learn the way yourself. That will be quite a trick. You will not be armed in any way. Oh, I see. Do what you must. Step a little closer. I... See, no inconvenience whatsoever. 
Everett must be paranoid. We all are. The Illuminati is getting a taste of its own medicine. Has he made any progress on the Great Death Virus? Your uplink provided the missing encryption key. He has been able to complete the work that Presser Tong began. I must see him at once. He is downstairs in the lab. Okay. This makes way more sense now then. Okay. Downstairs in the lab, but not that way. Oh, alright. So I thought I like massively broke things. I was kind of expecting for JC to just die during the conversation and he's just talking to a corpse. As the camera just like pans over to nothing because my character is actually just like knocked down on the on the ground on the side. Oh hey, cool robot. Re energy. Get some prod chargers back. A little kind of jumping puzzle. Yeah. Oops. 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 Excuse me, cat. Oh, hey. Good news, huh? Looks like we might pull this thing off. Alex, what are you doing here? Tong sent me. He wanted me to help with the decryption. Looks like Everett has it all figured out. Listen quickly. Tong doesn't trust the Illuminati. He sent me here to keep an eye on Everett. I see. How about the triads? Is the truth going to hold? Last I heard. But I guess we have other things to worry about now, huh? I'll keep you in touch through your info link. I'll try my best to keep you informed. Yes, do exactly that. Keep me informed. Alright, Alex. What's that? Oh, MP. Huh? And a viral electric. What the f Hold on. Alex, what's going on with this? <laughs> Man. Everything is just out of reach. What else do you gotta you say? You won't be hearing from Tong for a while. He had to leave Hong Kong. Why? The triads? He said he had some business to take care of. I don't know. He didn't look so good. Uh-oh. Either that or something was bothering him. The last thing he said to me, it was something about all the machines in his lab being useless. And then he cut off the connection. Useless for what? It was just an outburst. I don't know, but he wants me to wait here for instructions. JC, Tong is serious about Everett. He wants you to be careful. While you're in the air, I guess I'll be helping Everett prepare Daedalus for the attack. I hope he knows what he's doing. <sighs> the Echelon kernel was designed almost exclusively for collecting data, so we have to add functionality for memory wipes, thread termination, that kind of thing. It's not often you get to construct a software worm that might do some good for the world. Everett and Tong will need some control of the network if they're ever going to come out of hiding. Good luck at Vandenberg. Packing in. Suspension codes. 2384-6426. Uh... And what now? Do I even have enough time to hack this? 2384-6426. Here we are. Okay. Uh, 
Insurance Trading and Trading Development Access Security System. This week's code is PunCon. Especially worried with the recent turn of events, Bobby feeling the first signs of apprehension, and he tends to overreact when that happens. P-Y-N-C-H-O-N. For Toby? What's Toby's last name? <laughs> Four digits. Uh, I'd imagine neither of these. Because this is for suspension stuff. Yeah, fine. So this is where the Illuminati ended up after centuries of conspiring to rule the world. The conspiracy is about to begin again, JC, between you and me. Nicolette was wise to bring us together. Wise like her mother. The most effective partnerships, like Beth's and mine, arise from mutual necessity. I came to talk about the Grey Death. Atanwe says you cracked the virus. A trivial matter. Paige added nothing to the core design. However, what we need to construct is a carbonocarbon ROM module, not exactly a vaccine. Can it be done without a universal constructor? No, we need time on a UC. But I know where we might find one, and also gain access to the U.S. military networks. The U.S. military? To stop Icarus from completely destroying the Daedalus AI. Daedalus is a design of mine. It replaced the old Echelon 3 network. Echelon. The surveillance system for the United Nations. So Daedalus was an MJ-12 tool in Rebelled? More of a pattern matching error. It classified Majestic 12 as a terrorist group alongside the NSF and Silhouette. And alongside the Illuminati, right? Are you sure Daedalus is your ally? What matters to us is that it opposes Majestic 12. We must help it destroy their intelligence apparatus. But that will require the military networks. I have already contacted Gary Savage of X-51. The former Area 51 scientists. Are they still camped out at the Vandenberg Air Force Base? They are close to completing a UC and have the kind of connection Daedalus will need. Sounds like my pilot and I should head to Vandenberg. Yes, I took the liberty of radioing him. Here is the key to the helipad stairway. The door is in the foyer where Atanwe revived you. Good luck. I will be in contact. Shouldn't you, like, put a bag over my head or something before getting me out of here? If I'm not allowed to know what or where this place is. I know the password, but that's it. Okay, and that's also these open. <laughs> Shrug. I'm going to just drop the PS20, literally never going to remember to use it. I'm going to drop another ballistic armor because I'm probably never going to remember to use them either. Okay. Let's find a robot and discover how worthless these are. Some weapon mods and a multi-tool. I uh, honestly think I'm okay. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Two picks for this. He's probably going to care, right? I'm being very sussy. More people should care when I'm doing stuff like this. They did the one time in the... Uh, kind of office complex. And that was fun. Don't close me in here. I'm going to scare that cat so good. Oh, 
darts and a rebreather. And so many fish to murder. <sighs> Take that fish. Get tranked. there anything up here this is all just for well a bit of experience i suppose don't forget to say hi to your friend from unetco mr uh jacobson already bumped into him very thoughtful of tom my own computer technician i suppose he can help me prepare a comm link for daedalus mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you saw a piece of echelon 3 in beth's chateau we salvaged some of the hardware Did I? Surveillance used to be daemon based. Daedalus is more distributed. A blip of his code runs on every communication device on the planet. If we control communications, we can organize and the other side cannot. Lack of organization is exactly what has plagued X-51. They're great scientists, but isolated. They left Area 51 to protest Majestic 12's experiments. And that's what it amounted to, a protest. They don't even coordinate with the NSF which is headquartered a few hundred miles to the north. You see the need for global organization. Someone has to bring these disparate groups together. X-51 has assembled excellent technology. They just need someone to help them use it. You will be my representative at Vandenberg. I will trust you to find a way to manufacture the cure. Meanwhile, I have other preparations to make. I will trust you to find a way to manufacture the cure. Okay, be good. Meanwhile, I have okay. other preparations to make. We're good. It's just really almost disconnected. Very short quips all the time. Some of the best scientists in the world have joined up with Savage. I'll keep you updated on the situation here. Right, I still don't know what this is. Four tools is a bunch of tools, but actually. 4,500 some. Oh, I'm already a master of computer. Never mind. I guess I could train up in electronics. Is there anything else that I'd be interested in? Not really. Like a little bit of medicine, but that's kind of the extent of it. And so we're better at security bypassing. Uh, like a caco demon or oh, prototype AI program bioelectric mirror lock mechanism key and plasma clips JC Ditton 23 years old no residents no ancestors no employer no how do you know who I am? I'm a screech visitor with a complete summary of his file. I'm a prototype for a much larger system. What else do you know about me? Everything that can be known. Say that. Morpheus, apparently. Go on. Do you have proof about my ancestors? You are a planned organism. The offspring of knowledge and imagination, rather than of individuals. I'm engineered, so what? My brother and I suspected as much while we were growing up. You are carefully watched by many people. The unplanned organism is a question asked by nature and answered by death. You are another kind of question with another kind of answer. Are you programmed to invent riddles? I am a prototype for a much larger system. The heuristics language developed by Dr. Everett allows me to convey the highest and most succinct tier of any pyramidal construct of knowledge. How about a report on yourself? I was a prototype for Echelon 4. My instructions are to amuse visitors with information about themselves. I don't see anything amusing about spying on people. Human beings feel pleasure when they are watched. I have recorded their smiles as I tell them who they are. Some people just don't understand the dangers of indiscriminate surveillance. The need to be observed and understood was once satisfied by God. Now, we can implement the same functionality with data mining algorithms. 
Electronic surveillance hardly inspires reverence. Perhaps fear and obedience, but not reverence. God and the gods were apparitions of observation, judgment, and punishment. Other sentiments toward them were secondary. No one will ever worship a software entity peering at them through a camera. The human organism always worships. First, it was the gods. Then, it was fame, the observation and judgment of others. Next, it would be the self-aware systems you have built to realize truly omnipresent observation and judgment. You underestimate humankind's love of freedom. The individual desires judgment. Without that desire, the cohesion of groups is impossible. And so is civilization. The human being created civilization, not because of a willingness, but because of a need to be assimilated into higher orders of structure and meaning. God was a dream of good government. You will soon have your God, and you will make it with your own hands. I was made to assist you. I am a prototype of a much larger system. That's the extent of it. I am a prototype of a much larger system. Right. Okay. Uh... Cool. So, medical bot. Uh, right, we don't actually need any. We actually have something in every slot nowadays. I keep forgetting we got like a cranial and eyes thing. I somehow keep forgetting that. But we can, however. Uh, oops. Drop these. And upgrade. Radar transparency, make it even cheaper to use, or... Power recirculator. Look at that. So it's more efficient than using it. It should pay for itself plus a little bit, initially, and now it'll pay for itself definitely, and, uh... Should be like a proper discount, I guess, right? I would imagine. Yo, did you see that AI? While you're in the air, I guess I'll be helping Everett prepare Daedalus for the attack. Yeah. I hope he knows what he's doing. Okay. Yeah, fine. Mm. Where else did we have to go? This was definitely a dead end. So... Um, into you. Thanks, friend. It's actually pretty cheap using the speed thing. If I use the speed thing with the power circulator, should be like... You missed dinner, but help yourself to a snack. Snack? Soy food. Delicious. And money. And binoculars. That's not food. Do not to disturb Lucius de Beers. I will not disturb da bears. Do not worry. I'm eating that. Thank you for the soy food. It's been a real pleasure. I don't actually care to talk to you, though. I will take all of your stuff as I look for a mirror that I can use. Found it. Because <laughs> I got the, the mirror the code whatever blah, so I thought, all right, well, I've definitely missed something somewhere. And here we have it. There's something somewhere. Shrug. I got the password, but I don't know what the username is. Maybe it doesn't matter. Turn the cameras off. They're not linked to anything else. That's these guys. Eh? 8001. Ah. Any interesting things to discuss and pay no attention to Lucius, he complains at the slightest provocation. So that's the code for. What are you doing back here? Uh. Denton, right? Yeah. You're al alive in that thing? I am conscious. 
Tell Everett I am cold. He keeps me so cold. Who are you? Do you mind if I ask? The Supreme Enlightened. The leader of the Illuminati. I thought Everett was a leader. I am the leader. I brought the Illuminati up through the 20th century to the height of their power. I had presidents and premiers eating out of my hand. I am the one. Our decline is the result of my own. All we need is for me to get back on my feet. What, what did Everett tell you? Nothing. I merely await certain technologies. Then I will be restored. Everett has sworn it. What's the goal? Tell Everett that Lucius is cold. <laughs> uh. Okay, what about this terminal then? Yeah. I thought as much. He promised me. I'm so cold. Tell Everett I'm cold. I'll tell him you're cold. Fear not. Very, very cold. <sighs> Yeah, I got rid of it, huh? He's cold. <laughs> what the hell are you doing down there? You just killed Lucius De Beers, an old friend of mine. I know he wasn't doing very well and he was in pain. Still, I had my reasons for keeping him alive. For God's sake, he was the former leader of the Illuminati. Stop messing with my equipment and get to the helicopter. Uh, that it? That's it? That's all? I... I expected a little more. <laughs> it just it sounds mildly annoyed that that's happened. Lucius De Beer says he's cold. I know. 18 degrees Celsius, to be exact. Don't you think that's a little chilly? I keep his metabolism low so he will last. He is a good advisor. A one-man think tank, so to speak. He said he's the leader of the Illuminati. A harmless fantasy. He also thinks I'm going to restore his body. You aren't? The technology has been around for decades, but he does not need to know that. What the... F What's that computer system for? The one with the blue face for an interface? Oh, nothing, nothing. Just something for passing the time and amusing guests. It has access to quite a bit of information, including information about me. An old prototype, for Daedalus, actually. It doesn't really handle surveillance in its current state. So you have your own private echelon system. Mr. Denton, your pilot is waiting. You saw a piece of Echelon 3 in Beth's ship. Dude is like we so completely <laughs> like rogue operator. Man, screw this guy. I'm tattling. I'm telling dude, I guess I could recirculate power as well. I'm telling dude that there's like already things in place, but you're not doing anything for it. I'm telling him. Where is he? I will remember these small injustices when I am revived. I will remember. Everett has no intention of reviving you. He must. He has been commanded. He keeps you on ice so that he can benefit from your experience. But he intends to rule the order himself. No. No. I will not allow it. If I only had command of my body. Now even Everett betrays the Illuminati. 
Can no one be trusted? Young Denton, use the computer to my left. Find a way to shut me down. All I wanted was to touch the world one more time. Take one more breath of air. I will not be a prisoner. I command you. Kill me. I mean... If the technology's around... Then we could not kill you and it's fine. Dude doesn't know that I told you, so like, just hang in there, friend. It, it is fine. We will get you your body when this pulls out of the equation. But you don't have to be dead and stuff. Oh. I see. That one's nothing. What if I, uh... Okay, never mind. It would be rather serendipitous if Bob Page invented something Everett could not figure out. We have never failed to decipher Majestic 12's plans. Oh, you're Toby. Stopping them, however, has been another matter. Everett thinks you can help us. I hope he's right. So what, Tian Tanwa and then, uh... Pine... Pine Cone. <laughs> I guess. I don't know if there's an actual thing to use that on, and if that would actually give me anything that I didn't already have, but... Alright. Just got refueled. Been waiting for you. A dead guy? Sir, I found a body. Is there a problem? Just looking around. I, I checked her out. She's fueled up and ready to go. Is something wrong? Huh? No, I said I checked her out. You want the thing to run, right? If you're gonna cross the ocean. Of course. Better safe than sorry. I fixed her right up for you. Something wrong? I think your friend's ready to go. I got a pretty cush job, huh? I fixed her right up for you. Mm. A lamb. Great. I think I'm full up on lambs now, too. No, I got eight. And there's still a little more room. Why is there a dead body here? <laughs> uh. Okay. All right. I'll, um... I think we're okay to go. I talked to Savage. Sounds like Vandenberg may be in some trouble. Get in. Can't think of much Let's else go. to do. Like, the dude's security login, I'm pretty sure it's just like... If somehow you don't have enough time to hack and turn off the one or two cameras that are there, you've got to log in for infinite time. But like... 